Welcome back to Gun Locker 75. I was sitting around in the gun room the other day and I started looking like at the collection and thinking about well what guns have I not even shot yet and I came up with 10 guns. I have 10 guns in my current collection at the filming of this video um, that I have never fired yet. I have plans of doing videos on them. I have a whole list and everything, but I kind of looked around and was like, wow, there are 10 guns that I have not even shot yet. So, I don't know. I figure maybe some of you might be interested in seeing what those 10 guns are. I will shoot them. I shoot all my guns. I just, just haven't got to it. So, I guess we'll get started. We got this mini Draco. It has been featured in some videos, but I technically have never shot it. 762 by 39 I do want to switch the grip and the handguard and probably put a rail on it and kind of deck it out all black. So the mini Draco still needs to be fired. We got a Taurus 905 in 9mm takes the little moon clips so still needs to be fired we have a uh, we're just getting right into this people we have a mini 30 a Ruger mini 30 in 762 by 39 this one was made in like 94 it's in pretty good shape still need to shoot it we have the Colt SP-1 from 1975. This is my baby. Still haven't shot it yet. I've actually brought this to the range two different times. Ready to fire it. And they had some events going on and the range was real crowded. So it came back home with me not being fired. So still got to fire that. Uh, let's go down here. This has been featured in videos before. The Albanian SKS 762x39. Pretty rare. Said to only have about somewhere between six and eight thousand of these in the country. Most of them in horrible condition. This is a numbers matching in pretty good shape. This is the last year that they made them, uh, 1978. Pretty cool. Still got to shoot this. And we got the Ishapur. That's also been featured in a video. We did a, a sling installation. This is a 7.62x51 or 308. This is a 1967 Ishapur. Still have not shot this bad boy. I know, I know, I need to get to it. These are all on the list. I just keep getting things that go ahead of them. I don't have enough time. Oh, I actually went past one here. This one, I'm not 100% sure if I've shot it or not, but we're going to have to go for it. I had a different Arasaka, a darker one, which I did shoot a couple different times, never filmed it. And then I got this one because it has the mum still on it. And I got rid of the other one just because I was like, well, I mean, once you got the mum, you got it. So I don't believe I ever took this one out and fired it yet. And this is your 7.7 uh, .7 by 58 Japanese and this is the Type 99. This baby's beautiful. So we need to get out there with this. Pretty sure if my old memory serves me correct, we've never fired it. Uh, you've seen the K31. It's got its own video with showing the troop tag that was underneath here. Yeah, 
We haven't fired this one either. This rifle's beautiful. All kinds of plans to shoot it. Just hasn't happened yet. But the Swiss, I mean the Swiss, they make good rifles. Uh, what do we got? We just picked this up. Actually, we just picked up that Taurus too. This is a brand new Savage 116 Hunter in 30 odd six with the stainless barrel, the Nikon scope. This has got the Accu trigger. This is brand new, never fired. We'll change that pretty soon. This will jump in front of a lot of these other ones, which I have no idea why. It just just happens. And then last but not least, the Remington Wingmaster. And this is the one, it's got the chrome shell lifter. Uh, it had the serial number starts with an S. And if you do any kind of research on these, everybody basically says these were the best ones made with the S in the beginning and the chrome shell lifter. I'm trying to remember the year on this one. Uh, in the 60s somewhere, I believe, if I'm... I could be wrong, but I think it's in the 60s. Never fired it yet. 12 gauge. She's beautiful. I think that's like a 30 inch barrel. So, quick one today. Just figured maybe some of you would have an interest on what I have laying around here that's yet to be fired. And I've actually, I've had some guns where I never fired them and I got rid of them and I never filmed them. I mean, I probably could have <laughs> 200 videos just on guns that I could have filmed. So, yeah. And there's a, I, I have nightmares sometimes with the guns that I could have made a video on that I'll probably never have again. But such is life, you know. I mean, hey, I was privileged to have my hands on them and play around with them. So anyways, short one today. Those are my 10 current guns in my collection that I have yet to fire. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one.